Republicans on the House Intelligence Committee today released a 250-page report on Russian meddling in the 2016 election. Among the conclusions, no evidence of collusion, coordination, or conspiracy between the Trump campaign and the Russian government. And that Russia's intention was to undermine U.S. democracy, not to help candidate Trump. Nancy Cordes tells us Democrats on the committee immediately fired back. Nancy? Jeff, it's a pretty remarkable end to what was supposed to be a bipartisan, serious investigation. Now, Democrats on the committee are saying that the GOP findings are misleading and unsupported by the facts, releasing their own 98-page report in which Democrats say that this year-long congressional investigation actually identified repeated offers of assistance from Russians to the Trump campaign and a willingness by the campaign to accept that assistance, along with, quote, a pattern of deception surrounding those meetings. President Trump made it clear today he favors the Republican version. It was a great report. No collusion, which I knew anyway. No coordination, no nothing. Trust between the two sides on this House committee broke down early, which is why most lawmakers say the Senate Intelligence Committee report is the one they're really waiting for. Jeff? Nancy Cordes on the Hill tonight. Nancy, thanks.